Hello, this is Carolyn Herfords with The Biz Truth. Welcome back. Is it possible that our prospects are like teenagers? I love my teenage nephews. I have four of them. And they're so different from each other and are constantly changing. But each one has a key characteristic or gift that makes him stand out. One is popular, another one's athletic, another one is shy. I'm not quite sure how that one slipped into the Herfords gene pool. And the other one is just a little lover, hugger, talks to everybody. What they all have in common is that they don't know what they don't know. They're still finding their way and talking at them or telling them what to do is not terribly effective because they don't have context, so they may not understand why it's important. So if I tell my 16-year-old nephew, hey, don't drink and drive, he'll understand it, but will he do it? Will he buy it? Probably not. What if I ask him, hey, John, why do you think it's important not to drink and drive? That gets him talking. It gets him processing. It gets him engaged and better understand what happens when people drink and drive so we can have a conversation around it. I know that as a teenager and as an adult, I hate being talked at. The most effective lessons I learn are through equal exchanges. And the same goes through with, goes with our prospects. If we spend our time telling them why they need to do something and then go on to tell them why they need to use us to do that, there's no engagement, so it's less effective. So when we engage our prospects through thoughtful questions, it sinks in differently. They take more ownership of the problem and the solution. And in some cases, they identify a problem they didn't even see or know that they have or would have if they didn't take proactive measures. So give it a whirl. Come up with what your thoughtful questions are to engage your prospects and let me know how it goes. I want to thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.